This is me making a scratch game in just 10 seconds. Okay, that's the 10 second game done. Let's see if it works. Flappy Bird. Except it's a cat. It falls really slowly. And there's no obstacles. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's garbage. <laughs> in this video, I'll be remaking the same game in 10 minutes and one hour. Okay, let's start the timer for 10 minutes now. So you have to make the code and the art in 10 minutes. It's not just putting the blocks in. Everything in the game has to be 10 minutes. So this is our flappy bird. So we get that. Oh, beautiful. Okay, we might want some pipes. Okay, that looks all right. So this is the pipe that'll be at the bottom. We can duplicate that, flip vertical, and put it at the top. That's all the art done. Now I might need to make the flappy bird flap. This bird now actually has some sort of gravity, but it still kind of sucks, so I won't go into much detail about it. Well, that's not the best, but it, it's okay. So when you get to the bottom, you should die. I don't have much time, so the game over screen is just gonna be this. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so we game over. Now we need to make the pipes work. So they just spawn in, move to the side, then when they reach the end, they disappear. So we got pipes, they're moving. They weren't finished yet. I had to add collision. There we go. Score. So the more score you've got, the less time there is between the pipes, just to be more annoying. And more different types of pipes. A long one here, short one here. The pipes took a while, so I didn't have any remaining time to test it. Let's ch change the background. It's not gonna be a scrolling background, but we are gonna have a nice green blob. Oh, look at that sky, set it to the back. Whoa, that's a beautiful cloud right there. After I finished the background, I had 30 seconds remaining. I used this time to test the game, but I noticed a huge mistake. We've got pipes which blend in with the background. With mere seconds left, I decided to give the pipes an outline to make them different from the background. Oh, but no, if I give them a stroke, it won't work. Oh. The collision code from before uses the touching color block, but the pipes and the background are the same color. All I had to do was change the color of the background and it would all work but I changed the color of the pipes. I need to undo that real quick. The last few seconds were spent removing outlines. This did nothing to solve the problem. Okay, there's the timer done. How good is Flappy Bird in 10 minutes? It's still not gonna be good as the one hour game, but it should definitely be better than the 10 second one. So we've actually got a bird. We've got pipes, which blend in with the background. I didn't have enough time to give them a sh Oh, I lost. Wait. Oh, touching the mountains kills you. I don't know how I made it the same color as the pipes. Why did I do that? So the obstacle system is not fair. The grass kills you. And also the flapping isn't that good. And there's no sounds or anything. We'll have to fix all of those things in the one hour game. I've got an entire hour to make this game. Six times as long as the previous one. And yet I spent just over a minute making the bird. I took more time with the movement, however. We can flap, but not too much flapping. The movement's not the greatest, but it's okay. Okay, I might do some pipe. No, that, that looks right. Making this game was actually pretty chill. Game development doesn't have to be rushed and stressful. Just take your time. But this is a YouTube video, so let's speed things up a bit! Well, we got a scoring system now. Now I want to do some scrolling background, which I don't really know how to do off the top of my head. Okay, let's see if this scrolling works. <laughs> <laughs> I have no clue what I'm doing. Uh, maybe we can make a menu work, okay? Oh, look at that start screen. <laughs> okay, we'll fix it later. But now I'm adding a difficulty system. So the more score you get, the faster the pipes are. Okay, so we got a very slow pipe. We got another pipe. Oh, and it just instantly sped up. I was using all this fancy complicated math, but then I thought, what if I just use addition and it'll just get faster and faster until we lose. Okay, I think that's fun. Let's make a um, actual score counter. Oh, I said I can't use the assets, so I can't just use the numbers in here. I'll have to write my own numbers. And now for counting to 
Turn! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> But I needed to change the 10 to a 0 and add a blank costume. I've made a tutorial on this, but I forgot how this thing worked. I'm not allowed to use any of my tutorials, okay? I forget what the complicated math expression was. I have no clue what I'm doing. <laughs> what am I doing? Okay, I'm an idiot. Okay, it's still not working. <laughs> the number spacing is garbage. It's good enough, okay? Good games need sound effects, right? And um, since it has to be created by me, I'm going to use my voice. Boom. I don't know what these sound effects are. Okay, maybe maybe scoring a point should be like da -dum. I should also do a deaf sound. Da -dum. Okay, this one's pretty funny. Okay, you also need a button click. Then I imported all these sound effects into Scratch. I don't even realize I could just record it in Scratch. <laughs> I also need a flap sound. I've got a jump run so I can just slide my hand across the jumper file. I hooked up all the sound effects and gave it a play test. Da -dum. <laughs> da -dum. Maybe I can add some like effects to the bird, like some tilt. Uh, maybe we can point in direction of the movement. That doesn't make sense. Well, that actually kind of looks cool. I think it's pointing in the wrong direction though. I fixed it, but you'll have to see it at the end of the video. Wink. So let's add some like animations to the start screen. I wanted to animate the title text with the sign function because that makes sine waves which look cool. <laughs> that's that's a, a bit too much, I think. Uh, then I tried to fix it with the absolute value function. But you can tell how that turned out. <laughs> that's the. It's great, isn't it? Yeah, okay, that's that's good enough. <laughs> the game's kind of bland at the moment. We need some some scenery. It's not gonna be scrolling, because I don't know how to do that. Yep, I just took a minute to make a crappy hill. We can scroll these clouds across. And I spent three minutes to make these scrolling clouds, which just didn't work. They don't show up. And we don't have any music, and I can't make music. I guess I can try. There is a music extension. This is amazing music. Okay, <laughs> since I can't do anything with music in Scratch, I'm just gonna get Kevin McCloy. This is the best music site ever made. So let's get a bright, humorous action. Run a mop, what's this? So I added the music to the game and spent the last eight minutes failing to add the finishing touches. <laughs> okay, time is up. Let's see how good Flappy Bird made in one hour is. The start screen's a little bland, so... Let's start. Yep, we got some music. Sound effects. Epic score counter. The bird's a little on the lacking side. Oh, that was a hard one. It gets very fast very quick. Yeah, I lost. The full game is in the description. And while you're down there, consider subscribing.